television series are now spending as much as big budget films. There are many elements that must converge in order for a TV show to become a success that keeps the audience on their toes. There must be a plot that catches the viewer's attention, and the actors in charge of bringing the characters of that story to life. In order to live up to all these requirements, one thing is needed. Money. By themselves, TV productions usually cost a lot of money since the higher the quality. With that in mind, here are the most expensive television series ever produced. 10. The Sandman, $15 million per episode. Netflix's adaptation of the acclaimed graphic novel series of the same name was a breathtaking television experience and one that certainly matched its price. The Sandman, which follows the Lord of Dreams, Morpheus, cost about $15 million. This certainly explains why Netflix took so long to decide on a second season renewal, but they finally did, and audiences are eagerly anticipating the second season. 9. Game of Thrones, $15 million per episode. Premiering on HBO in 2011, Game of Thrones is one of the most popular shows in recent years. Based on the novel series by George R. R. Martin, it follows different storylines involving a group of characters from different noble houses who share a common goal of controlling the Iron Throne and ruling the seven kingdoms that make up the land. During its earlier seasons, the production had a budget of $6 million per episode, which went up as the seasons went on and more and more fans became part of the audience. For the final season, each episode had a budget of $15 million, covering not only the main characters' salaries, who were largely responsible for the show's success. 8. The Mandalorian, The Book of Boba Fett, $15 million. The Mandalorian became a global hit in the hands of director Jon Favreau, who is well known for his great contribution to the MCU. With this new TV series, Favreau contributed to broadening the Star Wars universe even further by recounting the story of a Mandalorian warrior set sometime after the fall of the Empire and prior to the emergence of the First Order. This Disney Plus series was extremely well received by the audience, and the production of a third season is already well underway. The trailer even leaked online, further adding to our anticipation of the future installment. 7. The Pacific, $20 million per episode. This was a television miniseries produced by HBO and set around World War II. It premiered in March 2010 and was based mainly on the memoirs of two American soldiers, with The Old Breed by Eugene Sledge and Helmet for My Pillow by Robert Leckie, in which both narrate their experiences during the battles against the Japanese Empire. Steven Spielberg and Tom Hanks participated in this project as producers and spared no budget to recreate the war scenes with outstanding visual effects. As a result, The Pacific ended up having a budget of $20 million per episode and earning a very good score on Rotten Tomatoes. 6. House of the Dragon, $20 million per episode. Game of Thrones was such a massive hit for HBO there was no way they would let it be the end of the story. In 2022 they premiered House of the Dragon, a prequel series that cost more than the original series. Each episode reportedly cost $20 million. Why the show is so much more expensive than its predecessor is unknown, but inflation likely plays a big part in it. The cost has paid off, as House of the Dragon has scored some of HBO's biggest ratings ever. 5. Marvel, Disney Shows, $25 million per episode. The undeniable success of the MCU films keeps on rising, bringing in more fans by the day. With the release of Spider-Man, No Way Home, Marvel shattered previous records, grossing over $1 billion in worldwide box offices in the midst of the COVID-19 pandemic. No wonder they decided to jump into producing TV shows to further develop their already successful characters. And when doing so, they spared no expense, for each episode of WandaVision, Loki, The Falcon and the Winter Soldier, and Hawkeye, $25 million per episode was spent. 4. Stranger Things, $30 million per episode. Stranger Things is, without a doubt, Netflix's biggest series. Starting in 2016, the series took everyone by surprise and became a cultural phenomenon. With each season, the scope becomes bigger, and expectations are higher. The price of each season has increased, both to match the epic story they are telling and also to pay the stars who become more famous each year. Season 4, which aired in 2022, 
cost about $30 million per episode. No word on when season 5 will air, but it will likely be another expensive entry, but it is doubtful it will top the number one most expensive series. 3. Secret Invasion, $35 million per episode. While most of the Marvel series average about $25 million, Secret Invasion gets its own section for being such an outlier. The series reportedly cost $35 million per episode, $10 million more than popular series like WandaVision or even more VFX-heavy series like The Falcon and the Winter Soldier and She-Hulk, Attorney at Law. 2. Citadel, $50 million per episode. Amazon Prime spends a lot of money on television series, as the top two entries belong to them. First is Citadel, an action spy series from producers Joe and Anthony Russo, most famous for their MCU films like Avengers, Infinity War and Avengers, Endgame. The spy series features an impressive cast that includes Richard Madden, Priyanka Chopra Jonas, Stanley Tucci, and Leslie Manville. Combine that with a global setting that sees lots of location shooting, the series' first season had a massive $300 million budget, which averaged $50 million over the first six episodes. 1. Rings of Power, $58 million per episode. Rings of Power set a new precedent for expensive television shows. Amazon Prime spared no expense to get the rights to the Lord of the Rings property and wanted the television series to match the scope of the iconic films. With a hefty $58 million, this prequel to the popular story is without a doubt the most expensive television series and one that will likely stand for a long time. 